camera up there. We'll get it here in a second. Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. Uh, today we're fishing the Santa Rosa Sound. Uh, picked up some fiddler crabs, so uh, going to see if we can uh, find something hanging by the docks. Uh, if not, we'll move over to the grass and look for some trout, maybe some redfish. So y'all stay tuned. Let's see what we'll get into. So we'll try all the techniques today. Got about three hours, three and a half. All right, y'all, here we go. Pulling up on the first set of docks. Got our little fiddlers in there. Y'all should be able to see them. start with these guys that water is fairly clear we'll see here all right y'all so quick update um about hour and a half and still not a single bite i did see some sheep's head cruising by it was about three of them um tried throwing at them but they were just on the move um so we're gonna keep on here at the docks for a couple for probably another 30 minutes and then go jump on some grass and try to find some trout. Would like to catch a fish today. Let's see if I can put a little trolling lure on here for now. Make our way to the grass. We're gonna put out this little guy. See so if we get chewed on. It's a little uh, Yozuri 3DS minnow in smelt color. Look at big old redfish or black drum right there. Man, just out here in the open. Saw me and darted off. There's something. Probably a lizard. I don't know how they do. Oh, for sure. Every time. see if we can find a bite as we move over the grass here I don't know how deep we are So pulling up to a different set of docks now and uh, see if we can salvage the day by picking up anything really. Um, we'll see here, a little bit shallower docks. So the reason we moved back over to the docks uh, was because these jet skis are ripping through over the grass flats and if anything, I think that's disrupting any fish that are uh, in the area. Oh. 
this way. I'm on this way. Oh, reverse. Come on, buddy. <laughs> Man, finally on a bite here. Took us a minute. If we can get him in the yak. Little redfish. Man. <sighs> Took us a bit. There it is. Got him in the corner of the mouth, so that's a good thing. Man. Come on, buddy. All right, looks like he is hooked very good. Oh, I'm just... Guess I ain't caught a fish in a while. Don't know how to handle them. Come on, buddy. Come on. There we go. Thank goodness. Nice little red. Nice blue tail. Two spots on each side. Thanks, buddy. Let's see if you got a couple more in here. Beautiful. Man. <laughs> Luckily, he wasn't bigger. Because uh, he definitely had us up against that structure there. And somehow, our braid and... Our flora survived, so let's keep at it here. I guess I'll take a bunch of those all day today if we can catch them. So let's hook this guy up. I won't throw him. Oh man, the shell broke on that. We'll see how well this guy survives. We'll go back over there and pitch this. go maybe something else is holding in here I almost thought it was a sheepy nibbling on it there if they did they took it okay <sighs> man tough day Heck yeah, dude. That's a sheep. Gotta be. Yep, that's a little sheepy. <laughs> Got us one. Not the biggest, but felt him nibbling there. Man. Little fella. <laughs> Get a picture of him and let him go. Let's get this guy released. All right, little fella, dude. It's like eight inches long. All right, y'all. That's gonna wrap it up for today's trip. A uh, little bit of a tough day on the water, but turned out to be all right. Uh, caught a couple fish, so not so bad. Uh, appreciate y'all tuning in and watching. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed the video, and I'll catch y'all next time.